this is Pat from the network.com and today we're going to be talking about white balance. What's the difference? So right now I have it on automatic white balance. I got some light in the background as you can see and I got some light over here coming from the side of the window. I got a little bit of darkness coming down from the stairs here so I thought this might be a good challenge and what I'm going to do is I'm going to get every single white balance option and just compare them so you guys can see with this lighting what the difference is. And I'm also going to do uh, white balance with a white balance sheet and I'll do that and we'll be able to see the differences in, in filming. So uh, here it is. This is the automatic white balance here and uh, we're going to try the next one now. Hey, so this is the outdoor setting. Outdoor setting. Uh, sunny days. This is the setting you'd have. This is what it looks like inside. Hey, I'm back again. This is the cloudy setting. So this one is for fluorescent lighting. No fluorescent lighting on. So this is the manual white setting that I set using a white sheet of paper. It was uh, I'm using a the, the whitest paper I could find. It's like almost it's not glossy, but it's matte, but it's still very very white. It's the whitest stuff I had. So I was going to try and use a photo uh, paper. I might try that next time. But for now, this is what it's looking like. So now, I'm curious. Which one do you prefer? Which one do you think looks better? And let me know why. Personally, I like the auto one. I think that looks pretty cool. But the white balance to me, the one I did manually, looks more natural. Let me know what you think. If you like us, give us a thumbs up. If you didn't think this helped at all, give us a thumbs down and let us know what you think in the comments below. Also, remember to subscribe because you never know what's going to happen here. As I'm learning filming, I'm going to try and put some of these things that I'm trying to learn up. Have a good one. Pat from NetNamo.com.